welcome back in this video we are going to configure static routing also we are going to verify network connectivity here we can see configure static routing create a static route from the isp router to the gateway router so we are going to uh, configure the static routing on the router isp coming to the router isp it's prompted for the password console password we given a cisco enable your the password prompted we given us class secret password now here we are going to uh, configure terminal and we are going to give ip a root 209.165.200.224 now we have to give a destination prefix mask 255.255.255.248 then forwarding routers address 209.165.201.18 next is create a default route from the gateway router to the ISP router here we can see that command coming to uh, gateway router password is Cisco here the password is class configure terminal IP root 0.0.0.0, .0 space 0.0.0.0, .0 .0 .0 .0 .0 0 .0 space 209.165. 201.17 next is verify network connectivity from the PC host ping the gigabit Ethernet 0 slash 1 interface on the gateway router troubleshoot if the pings are unsuccessful we will do that first of all we will do it from PCA command prompt ping to G0 slash 1, the IP address is 192.168.1.1. Here we can see we are getting the replay. Now we will go to the next PC, PCB. Ping to 192.168.1.1. We are getting the replay. And now we will go to PCC. Ping to 192.168.1.1. We are getting the replay. Coming to B, verify that the static routes are configured correctly on both routers. Coming to our packet tracer, we will come to gateway and we will verify that. Show IP route and here we can see default route what we set it's correct now we will go to ISP show IP route we can see only static here we can see that it's correct well in this video we configured static routing also we verified network connectivity next video we will configure and verify NAT pool overload